John here. Yesterday, I recommend you and reviewed you this book, The King Chronicles, Book One, The Red Pyramid. Well, today, I'm going to recommend you and review you the second book of the King Chronicles series. It's called The Throne of Fire. Inside, Sadie and Carter Kane needs to help the Lord of the Sun, Ra, the ex-king of the gods, to regain his throne and unite the magicians against Apophis. And in the meantime, they had to gamble with Khonsu, the moon god, who gave them an extra three hours to rescue Ra. Oh, and hilarious part is when he said, the sun boat ground to a halt on the scarab shell beach. Ra warbled, hello, and stumbled to his feet. He began chasing a blue cement orb around the deck as if it were a pretty butterfly. I really like that part because it described how senile and old Ra had been and playful and childish. <laughs> Another hilarious part, we, as he said, as we descended over the enemy, old Ra, yes, he was still just as senile and withered as ever, leaned over the side and waved at everyone with his croup. Hello, zebras. Both sides looked up in amazement. Ra, one of them screamed. Then everyone took up the cry, Ra, Ra, Ra! They sounded like the world's most terrified pep squad. The Uri stopped spitting fire, much to Freak's surprise, and immediately flew to the sunboat. They began circling us like an honor guard, and remember what Meshikov has said about them originally being the creatures of Ra. Apparently, they recognized their their old master. Emphasis on old. I also like that part because it was just as funny as the first part I taught you about. And it also kind of like the demons kind of switch sides or they remember their old master, Ra. One meaningful and immoral part is when Jazz said to Sadie, Think about Isis, Jazz repeated, and Sadie, there is a purpose. You taught us that. We chose to believe in Ma'at. We create order out of chaos, beauty and meaning out of ugly randomness. That is what Egypt is all about. That is why its name, its Ren, has endured for Milena. Don't despair, otherwise chaos wins. It was really like a moral because if you panic and if you despair, really, the chaos and the randomness takes over you. So we should become more confident about things and have courage. Okay, that's the end of our review. Please like and subscribe. Follow me and read more. See you next time.